Hello there, guardians, and welcome to another Snowbreak Containment Zone video. So, we have here a free advanced manifestation invitation letter. It's going to be given to us on the next update, which is November 2. So, in the event shop, Seabreeze Market, choose one of the five orange tier operatives to join your team so let me just uh, this is actually too obvious to some but for those who are planning to join just now let's say they're gonna be joining november 2 they're gonna be wanting to know which or who to prioritize so for those who already know more or less you're gonna be picking your favorites but for those who are not familiar with these characters who are gonna go who are gonna pick so we'll start off with the most obvious ones um if you're into a sniper uh, best DPS will be Yao. So if you're going for DPS and if you like a sniper rifle, definitely Yao is your priority one, if that is your choice. Number two for Fenny. Fenny, if you're into shotguns, she's also uh, large on DPS. Um, you can't go wrong with this too. It's more on play style that I am going to be, you know, giving you the decision whether you're going with a sniper for Yao or a shotgun with Fenny. So both of them um, can be toe-to-toe -to -toe in, to in terms of DPS, depending on the stage, depending on the enemy that they are currently facing. Okay, so with that out of the way, those are your top two. What if you, you're not into those two? You are going uh, to other, you know, choices that are in the board. So if you're not into Yao and with uh, Yao and Fenny, then definitely your next pick will be Life Wild Hunt. Most of the players didn't pull for Wild Hunt because they didn't want Wild Hunt in their lineup. She is basically the pick of most of the advanced players who don't have Wild Hunt in their roster. So now is the best time to get her. Um, she's terrific in mobs, uh, crowd control with freeze. Definitely, she's going to be your third pick, and I think most of the advanced players will be picking her. Most advanced players already have um, Yao and Fenny. Beginners, you begin with Yao and Fenny, unless if you want Yao, if you want life in terms of the play style, in terms of crown control, in terms of um, mob clearing, then life is your girl. Okay, for the rest, um, we have Marion Swift. Uh, if you're into Marion Swift's uh, kit, um, if you're a beginner, I would suggest that you still pick Yao over Marion. Both of them are just sniper, you know, use sniper rifles. But like me, for example, there might be a chance that I, be, I might be picking Marion Swift because I don't have her yet in my roster. So that is the only reason why I'm picking her because I want to complete the whole set. But again, I would highly recommend that you go with Yao instead of Marion if you're going to... If you want your life to be easier as a beginner, go with Yao. Okay, and the last one and the least that you should pick is definitely Free Shahush. Unless if you're... Again, if you're a beginner, if you want a, an um, automatic rifle, then definitely go with Free Sha. But I do not recommend her at this point because the first three are the best picks for a beginner. Unless you really prefer the gun. But again, the first three picks are are the best for beginners. Yao, Fenny, and Life. Frisha, I don't recommend that anybody pick her because there is Chen Xing uh, for the five star for the rifle. And at this point, she is already... She doesn't have kind of her niche in the game. There are other um, operatives that can take her place, especially Chen Xing. Especially for for even for control, there are a lot of options around that. I don't recommend you guys pulling for Freesia at this point. So that is it. So who are you gonna get? Who are you gonna pick? Please comment down in the comment section and let's see your your opinions or options or your choice. So again, guys, those are my thoughts. Thank you very much. Take care. Stay safe. This is the warden, and I'm out of here.